Hello everyone, Alex here, or as you know me, the Devious Melon. And lately, I've seen a few different YouTubers talking about the state of the game we all know, SCP Secret Laboratory, and its community. Luckily for me and my friends, we have a private server, and as a result of that, we have a completely different take on the game, and don't have to deal with any of that. But one thing we've noticed more and more throughout the updates of the game, is the weird absence of horror. Of course, there can be horror found in Secret Labs, like with SCP-939, but when it's player dependent, you often end up with this instead. Nothing wrong with that as it is fun, but the horror I'm talking about comes more from the environment and situations you as a player would find yourself in. There are three different topics that I deem important to the game that I believe Norfolk needs to keep in mind when shaping the future of Secret Laboratory. So without wasting any more time, let's get into this. <laughs> Very well. Ever since Mimicry dropped in 2022, the lighting in Secret Labs has become more and more bright, to the point that Heavy Containment Zone went from looking like this, to this. Now, this change is purely a visual one, but it also makes a stark difference in the atmosphere of the facility. Post Mimicry, the hallways of Heavy Containment were something to be feared, as this is where the containment breach initially occurred, to now where Heavy looks like the most welcoming and well-lit place on the map. The original lighting would also make the textures of the facility pop a lot more, which is more appealing to the eye. Whereas now, I can see that it is brighter to be more readable for gameplay, but as a result, the textures look so much more flat and lacking any personality. Of course, you can turn down the brightness, but the fact that the default setting is set to this shows that Northwood intends for you to play like this. Also, turning down the brightness seems to just make the contrast of the shadows darker, with the lights just looking a bit cursed to my taste. Oh, and while we're on the topic of lighting, Northwood, what is this? The shadows are here, but the moon is over here? If that even is a moon? Fix your skybox? It's an easy fix too, just change the rotation of the skybox in Unity. I'm no expert, but I don't see any light here emitting these shadows. Now, something that's rarely bothered me is the lacking or outright removal of the sound cues and SCP themes in the game. Originally, when you would look at an SCP, you would hear this sound. Oh my god! Compared to now, when you look at an SCP that isn't 173, you get this. Um. You can already see the massive difference this makes. Originally, seeing an SCP was a scare factor, and this sound cube went along to emphasize that. Now it's just seeing the warp and sample that Timmy put together. Now, I understand why they may have removed it, as it is a containment breach sound and Nova wants to steer away from using their assets. But until you got new ones, why not just use them? They also removed the music that occurs when you're alone in the game for a long period of time. Here's a little look at what that was like. Before, being alone in Secret Labs was something to be feared, and this background music would accompany that feeling of fear, whereas now it's just another part of the game. Another area where the sound cues are completely removed is the lobby menu. There used to be the occasional noises of the facility, but now it's completely silent and void of any style that it once had. Now these sound effects would also occur during gameplay, and it would add to the feeling of there's something more going on that you don't know about. Northwood. Why is everything so damn quiet now? I really do feel that removing these things hurts the identity of the game. I could see them making new and original themes, like they did with SCP-173, but until that is ready, why remove what was already there and working? Now, this point is very subjective, but I feel it's important to Secret Laboratory. So. When you're on the starting screen of Secret Labs, there's a little bit of writing at the bottom right that says, 
based off SCP Containment Breach, which sends you to the Containment Breach website. Now of course the words based off can be taken very loosely, as they may have only been inspired by certain aspects of that game, but I do feel like Secret Labs and Containment Breach are very different when it comes to horror. For example, venturing into heavy containment and Containment Breach is a scary and risky experience, one in which you don't know what creatures you're going to discover, or if you're even going to make out alive. It's dark, it's grim, you get the sense that pure evil is down here. And with Secret Labs? You get the most clean, well-lit place in the facility. Just look at those beautiful repeated hallways you've seen a hundred times. You bloody love it. Again, this part can be taught completely subjective, as there is the difference of Containment Breach being PvE, with Secret Labs being PvP. But man, the parts of this game that is completely made for Norfolk do feel lacking in spirit at times. So, with all that being said, what do I think could be done to make the horror of this game be at its full potential? Well, step one is easy. Lower the brightness of the facility. Make it feel more spooky and dangerous to traverse this facility. Also, while we're at it, add more environmental storytelling to the facility. Like in SCP-096's chamber. Have blood scattered on the walls, have lights flickering and damage to the walls. Step two. Bring back the audio cues and SCP themes to the game. From what I've seen from the pear bills or apple lemon, whatever it's called, it's going in a good direction. But I feel this game needs something more than the brand new sound effect of SCP-106 having an intense asthma battle. Just listen to the little weirdo. Bring back that feeling of isolation and dread. And step number three. Just honour the game you base this off horror-wise. Of course you want Secret Laboratory to be its own unique thing, but it is important to know what SCP is truly about, which is scaring the absolute shit out of me. Oh, wait. Oh, no! Oh, no! There are yourselves. What? No! What the fuck? What the fuck? Now, if I'm being honest, if I want a gun balancing, I'd play CSGO. Yo, this is your health, mate. It is a full of shot. No, <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. Also, off topic, but could you add more achievements to the game, please? I, I like achievements. But with all that said and done, I do believe Northwood has good intentions with this game. The recent updates to this game have been truly a great experience, and I'm looking forward to what this game can bring in the future, and hope that the horror becomes a lot more into what it used to be. Right. Gotta do an outro now. So oh, feel free to join my Discord if you want. Link is in the description. Uh, yeah. Goodbye, everyone.